Hi folks, this is probably one of the world's cheapest Inmarsat reception systems. This is a very small uh, 45 centimeters diameter dish. Um, it's using a lock periodic antenna uh, at the feet. This one is specified from 900 megahertz to 2.6 gigahertz continuous uh, coverage. So it's a very tiny antenna. And what I have here, you can hardly see it. I have to use a few adapters because I didn't have other ones. But there is a, a very tiny here uh, USB DVB-T stick. And that's the actual receiver here. That's it. It's uh, streaming an IQ stream into the PC through the USB cable. Which is here. And what we have here is an Inmarsat signal. It's a little bit of frequency. The nominal frequency is 1541.425 for the network control channel on Inmarsat Atlantic Ocean region on 15 degrees west, a geostationary satellite. Signal to noise ratio is um, close to 20 dB. No preamp, as you have seen before, just the DVB-T USB stick. And we are seeing here a total bandwidth of 1 MHz. It's, uh, this uh, tuner is using, or this USB stick is using the same tuner chip as a famous FunCube dongle. The only difference is that you have a wide band signal here. And if we would uh, zoom into this one, if we apply the zoom there, we will get a similar signal as on a FunCube dongle. Uh, how much do we have right now? Yeah, we have roughly 100 kilohertz uh, bandwidth now, which is roughly what you would see on a FunCube dongle as well. So it's only a little snapshot of the overall bandwidth. So for um, for very low cost, you can build an Inmarsat uh, reception system. The sound that you hear here out of the speaker, you could uh, feed into a decoding software and decode the Inmarsat C uh, digital signal. This is a 1200 baud BPSK signal and um, there are some decoders available on the internet. I hope you enjoyed this low cost system and uh, if you own one of these DVB-T sticks Maybe you will try it uh, someday on your own. Thank you for watching.